All right, in this video, I want to talk about functions and the vertical line test. And the basic idea is if you have a graph and you want to decide if that graph represents a function, the idea is if you were to draw any vertical line and if it touches the graph in two or more places, then the graph does not represent a function. Uh, nothing, nothing worse than that. So here's uh, three different graphs. Um, so let's look at the one here on the left. Um, kind of looks like a parabola or sort of like a lazy u. We want to decide if that would represent a function. Okay. Well, again, the idea is, to me, you know, it, the arrows, it's kind of always opening to the left and always opening a little bit and moving to the right. Well, to me, that says no matter where I were, you know, no matter where I was to put a vertical line, it would hit the graph in at most one place. And since it doesn't hit the graph in two or more places, so since it only hits the graph in at most one place, we would say yes, that graph uh, is a function. Okay, so let's look at this graph in the middle. Notice on the left side, if we were to draw vertical lines, it would only hit it in one place. But notice, for example, the y-axis hits the graph in two places, and there's definitely some... Uh, some lines to the right of the y-axis, vertical lines where it would hit the graph in two places. So in that case we would say no, not a function. Okay, and then we have a graph over here on the right. Uh, notice it's not one smooth graph, there's a break in it. Okay, if it's not kind of one smooth piece, we say it's not continuous. Okay, so that's okay. A graph could be not continuous and be a function, and I think this one would be a function because no matter where I put a vertical line, to me it's going to hit the graph in at most one place. Notice there's, there's some places where the vertical line won't hit the graph at all, but that's okay. As long as vertical lines don't hit it in two or more places. Likewise, any vertical line on the right would hit it in at most one place. So we would say yes, this graph um, is a function.